Hello, hello, people of the internet. Welcome your faces back to another episode on the Minecraft Let's Play. My name is Ethix, and today, the goal of this episode is going to be... Uh, I just enchanted that. I just put Unbreaking on that. I enchanted Bow. It's pretty Garbo. And we got Protection 3 there, so I'm just going to leave this stuff in here for now. So the goal of the episode, for now, is going to be we are going to build a park. A kind of a parking, like, shopping area. And for that, we're gonna need a lot of wool, so we're gonna, uh, gonna have to go, gonna have to go breed some sheep. That's for sure. Sadly, we have a lot of cows, but we don't have a lot of sheep. So it's going to be like a 31 by 31 square. Um, not quite like a town. It's like a, it's like the center of town. I'm gonna put it like right here. Uh, I think. Gonna dig down a layer here, and then. It's going to have kind of like a fountain in the middle, and then it's going to have different tents with different colors, selling different things. Um, I may or may not get villagers in there one way, or one day, or another, uh, selling the stuff. That could actually be a... Ooh, that could be the villager trading section. That's not a bad idea. I just came up with that. I'm, I'm smart like that. Um, so, we're going to need a lot of wool. So, I don't have any... Uh, wheat to breed these guys with right now, so that isn't exactly ideal, but we're gonna we're gonna deal with it. Come on, keep giving me wool. Keep on coming. Oh wow, I got over a stack of red at least. All right, let's get out of here real quick. Uh, uh, okay, let's dig down right here, and um, directly in the middle, we're going to put a fountain. And then we're gonna have a grapple path. It's gonna be a square. It's like just a boring square, pretty much. Oh. It's fine. It'll float, right? It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> that scared me for a second. Um, and then, yeah. Oh, I need leaves. So let's go ahead and get some leaves. It's going to be, it's going to be very lush. Okay. Well, <laughs> uh, it's going to be very lush and green. It's going to have bushes all the way around. It's going to have cool lights. And I built some redstone lamps. Um, off screen. I did a little bit. I finished the pond right here. I filled it up with water. So last episode, if you saw it, if you're new around here, hello. Welcome, your face. I'm glad that you're here. Um, so I, I finished that. But if you are new here or if you're a returning viewer, let me know in the comments. I'd, I'd be curious to see how many of you are new seeing this video as compared to people that have already seen it. I know not everybody comments, but need I remind you, YouTube videos, not YouTube videos, YouTube accounts are, in fact, free. You don't have to pay for it. You you can just sign up real quick. You, everybody's got an email nowadays. If you're watching this, I know you have an email. It's super, super quick. Takes it like three minutes. Go ahead. Go ahead and make an account. Maybe subscribe. Maybe. Maybe. If, if you're feeling, if you're feeling a little, uh, a little edgy, you know, a little, little smart, little, uh, I, I don't know the word, but cool. If you want to feel cool. That's uh, definitely something that you should do is subscribe to the channel. You you know you know you want to. You know you want to. And uh, yeah, then you can comment in the videos and like them and all that. So that would be very much appreciated. Who do you think you are? I like how my first instinct when I see this guy is to pull out my sword. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm kind of on edge here. You have glowstone. Uh, um, hmm. Just look at the flowers. Just, 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 just look at the flowers. Just, just stop spitting on me. <laughs> just, just look at the flowers. I, I, I know it's not necessary to kill these, but, um, you know, I want the leads and leather is, is always a good thing to have around. So it's a win-win, right? It's a win-win. So this area seems to be good enough. Do I want to build up? It's, I kind of want to flatten the area here. So I think the best course of action would be to flatten this a down a layer. So um, I'm just going to time lapse that real quick. Just real quick. Okay, we got this area flattened down a layer, which was nice and easy. I am so, like, like you get, if you get further into the game and you get good tools, 
and then you have them for a long time, you get so used to it. But when you start off in, in a new world again and you have to work your way back up to it, the new good tools are just so underestimated. I swear it's it's just a night and day difference. It's such a, a luxury to have. Uh, I can't really get up here real easy. I'm going to knock this down real quick. All right, so I knocked down the tree. And I pulled a bit of a B-dubs, and I filled in a bit of a hole without filling it. <laughs> so, next thing that we need to do real quick is we need to do the comments sign of the video. Um, I just realized that I, I goofed and I didn't resize my my OBS, so now I have to go over and uh, switch that out real quick. I need to change this to cobble, so it's more permanent. And this is going to be episode 12. Uh, oh, I, dang, I, I did it on the wrong thing. Episode 12. Uh, one second. Alrighty, this comment is by Matt. Oh, that's not how you spell Matt. Matt. Uh, YouTube. I, okay. I just can't spell. I think that's what this comes down to. But they said, let's go! My favorite Minecraft series. Yo, that's, that's very cool to hear. Like, I never thought that, um... You know, anybody would enjoy this as much as I'm enjoying making it. So the fact that you guys are indeed enjoying the series so far, those of you who are new and sticking around, I appreciate your faces for being here. It means a lot to me, and uh, I'm glad to know that people are doing it. Or <laughs> I'm glad to know that people are enjoying it because I want to keep on doing it. So you're just making my day, so I appreciate you. Um, Let's get rid of all this junk on the ground real quick. So... I need to put down a, I need a, I need a count. So, you know what? An easy way to avoid counting. There we go. <laughs> it's going to be 31 by 31. And I kind of want it closer to this side because it's going to be closer to the quote unquote lower end district. And then in medium, medium area and then high end area over where the castle is going to be. So, let's knock down a few of these. And, oh crap. Dang it. 31. You no, know, uh, you know what? We're gonna pick up these by accident. So let's just do that, and then get that. Oh, perfect. Sweet. Okay, let's start from over here because this is kind of gonna be the the spot that matters the most. I'm thinking about doing a bit of a raised kind of boardwalk right here instead of trying to work with the land being higher. I think that would be a cool idea. Maybe just like a road instead of a boardwalk. But either way, uh, there's room for expansion. Don't have to worry about that right now. All right, so let's do it on. Let's just do it on this block. So there, and that, and we do this all the way across. Thirty-one, all the way this way. Uh oh. Uh oh. All the way this way. That's a little close. That's that's a that's a little close. You know. I think, ooh, I see some water I didn't finish. I think to avoid it being too close to the water, outside of the fact I could round it off. Um, and I could also, you, no, it's fine. We'll roll with it. You got to learn to adapt in Minecraft, especially in building. So let's just roll with it. Um, this one will need to be 30 and then we'll go this way. So get all these plants out of the way right here. And then we build this way. Oh, do, 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 do. Hello, bees. Move. There we go. And then another. <laughs> uh, this will be 30 as well because we already got a block there. And then on all four sides, maybe not that side. Maybe not this. Okay, at least on two sides. Really, tree? Why do you, why do you got to be in the way? Why are you just in the right block at the wrong time? Wrong block in the wrong time, I suppose. Okay, I guess I'm going to have to fill up the rest of this hole like B-dubs and just skip over filling it for now. Is that a big tree? No, it's fine. Oops. That's fine. Uh-oh. Uh, <laughs> I think I picked up a leaf. All right, it's on this block right here. All the way around. Bring it around town. Right here. Then we build across. All the way across. Yeah, I definitely picked up a block. All right, let's fill in this a little bit. All the way around. Because I I don't want to 
fill it in right now. I, I just, I don't want to fill all this in right now. I've got, I've got a limited amount of time for the video. I don't want to go over an hour. That's the goal. I want to keep these under or around an hour. If I go over, then, then uh, I've failed. Unless it's a special episode, in which case. So I'm thinking about maybe, maybe episode 30, depending on how quick we get there. Maybe episode 10. 10, oh my goodness. No, maybe episode around 50, 30 or 50, depending on like timing and everything. I want to do like a big live stream. <gasps> Fat bull! I want to do a big live stream episode, which will be uh, like several hours long. Um, so yeah, it will be on YouTube and then I'll upload the VOD straight there. Like it, it'll just be up as soon as I'm done. And uh, I think that you can see the live chat in a replay um like you'll see the chat as it appeared in the stream you can't chat yourself obviously because it's in it's after it's already been live <laughs> so uh but you can still see it and you can still comment so that's the way i believe it works on youtube um i've been i've been streaming a few times on youtube recently i recently streamed the forest am i really out of dirt right now I streamed the forest with two of my friends, uh, Lautner and Random Obsessor. I can't even say her name right. <laughs> uh, we streamed the forest together, and that was a lot of fun. Uh, a video is actually going to be posted. The video is live right now. By the time you're seeing this, this is going to be posted Sunday, and I'm going to post that video. Ah, uh, brain fart. The Saturday, the day before this. Okay, let's count directly in the middle. So I need to be, I need to be in the middle for this. Uh, it's gonna be five, a five wide entrance. So here's where I do math, or I just eyeball it. I believe this is the center, right, right here. Yeah, that looks like the center to me. One, two, three, four, five. Let's see, let's see if I'm right. All right, let's count it. Let's see if I'm good. Let's see how good I am at this game. So it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Uh, I think I'm off. I think I'm off by one. One. This way. 1, 2, 3, 4. What? Uh, <laughs> I wanted to put some light in my hand. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. I am the best! <laughs> I am so good at this game. Ugh. Um, sorry. <laughs> all right, stop patting yourself on the back, bud. Right, I'm gonna dig a path all the way around, or all the way through here, and then I'm gonna do the same that way. Um, then there's gonna be a fountain directly in the middle, and then we're gonna we're gonna have to go get some gravel. So maybe by the end, roughly of the episode, we're gonna gonna go ahead and go over somewhere and get some gravel because we need that desperately for our builds and and just in general like i want to fill in the uh the little ponds the river hello i knew i heard you you sneaky little shit get out of here with your mean buck ass teeth okay uh yeah so we need gravel also need sand but that's another day's problem okay we dug this all the way through. Now, let's just do this again real quick. I know I need 13 in. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Then that's where the next possible entrance will be. I don't know if it's going to be an actual entrance. Maybe I can build a stairway up like a, like a gravel. You sound gross. Just listen to that real quick. That's a... That's a gross sound. It's actually synced with each drop. I didn't even know that. Like, usually you just expect it to be like a random sound file, but no, it's synced with each drop. I didn't even know that. See, so yeah, I can build a staircase up, and then we'll have a... a bit of a... a... a, a pathway. Like a... like a... gravel pathway. <laughs> I'm gonna be using gravel a lot. That's... that's the moral of this story. Alright, let's light this area up a little bit. And then let's work on our fountain. All right, all right. We need some stone bricks. Also, yes, I'm aware I don't have to 
put so many torches down, but I, I want to see. I don't really worry about mobs. I just want to see. So let's bring uh, more of these all the way around. Go ahead and make the perimeter. And I should have counted, but it's whatever. Where's the center? Right here's the center. Bop, bop, bop. One, two, three, four, five. I'm so... Oh, <laughs> I'm so good. Um, Let's just... This way. That way I, I kind of know. And then I'm in the center right here. This way. So how have you guys been doing? It's been a week, give or take, since I was last on, since the last video went out. Um, a little over at, at the point you're seeing this, but how you, how you doing? How's the, how's the fam or all the friends or, you know, anybody, the dog, the, the chipmunk, whatever you have as a pet. What am I looking for? I need to empty my inventory. That's one thing for sure. Let's go up here to this chest. Let's put that there because it's dark. Yes, I'm going to finish this building. This is going to be the, uh, it's just like a general shop in the apothecary next to it. Uh, and then we have the tent thing outside. It's like a, it's like a carnival shop, really. Ooh, maybe, ooh, maybe we can have it like a target game. Like how you have to throw an egg or something at the thing and then you get a prize. Can you hit targets? Do targets activate with eggs? Because if you did, you could throw eggs at the targets. If you get all three within like a second or whatever, then something like a prize will pop out like food or something. That's a cool idea. I don't know if it's possible. I, I mean, you could do it with buttons, right? Like a bow at the very least. I know you could work with that. Huh. Let me know if you want to see that. Because that, that sounds like a cool idea. That sounds like a, a possibility. Alright, so this is going to be... 5 by 5. Which is ironic. Because that's how this is. Um, And then... Then we're going to put a block there. And need to make some walls. Oh, so let's make a few walls. I just need, I think one is good enough, right? And then some stairs. This is probably going to take up all of my cobble. I still need more than this. Well, well, poop. Well, poop. Um, all right, there's an easy way to solve this right over here. Let's dig a little bit of copper. Oh, this is, <laughs> I'm so touched. Dang it. All right, we're going over to the house. We might as well sleep while we're over there. Grab some more cobble. Um, I kind of want to make, kind of want to make, I don't know. Maybe, wait, hold up. I have an idea. This isn't going to be enough, but, oh, I still need. I have that. Okay, hold up. I can do that. And then I can do that. Yes, I hear you, zombie. Blech. And then... Oh, I'm so smart! Oh, I'm just a genius today. I'm on it. Ooh. Ooh! It's almost full health. Uh, I got... I got chainmail legs. It doesn't even look that much different. <laughs> oh, well. It's whatever. I'll, I'll take it. I'll take it. Place that down. I don't I don't need this stuff. My inventory is so packed full of shit. I have so many cornflowers and everything. It's just an, an annoyance. Okay. <gasps> oh, it's a witch. I thought it was a, a villager. I was like, maybe I can get them. But no. Uh, like a shower. Can I put it? I want to put it on top. Can I put it on top, please? Pretty please. Will this even work? This probably isn't even going to work. Um, I'm going to make a source. That way, I can, I can know. Ah! God, I'm smart. Oh! Oh, I wanted like that. Uh, ah. Uh, is all this, is all this a source? No! I think we're good. I think we're good. And now we have a fountain. A cute little fountain. Nothing special. Doesn't need to be special. It can be its own little thing. Um, now, I think 
what would be cool is let's build a fence or two. Maybe we can do it all the way around. Uh, yeah, might as well do four, right? Uh, four fences and four lanterns. This is okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. I I don't have enough for all four, but that's that's fine. That's fine. And then when we make some, we can put some sunlight detectors, daylight detectors, whatever, and uh, then they'll they'll turn on and off during the day. Just invert them and. That'll be, that'll be get good. That that that's that's all right, donkey. That's that that I'll do. That I'll do, donkey. There's so many bees around. You know, one cool thing here is in the bushes that we're gonna add up. Um, we can put the beehives in the bushes. I don't know if they can enter from the top. I don't know if it has to be the side or the bottom. But I would assume they could go in the top, right? That makes sense. I I think that makes sense, right? Uh, a few more sticks, a few more wood, lack of oh, oh, yeah, okay, last one, huh. Huh. there we go, and we're good, we're golden, I think that's a bit too much, um, it, they're just too close together, or I could do like, ooh, hold up, I don't need to be doing this right now, but I'm going to anyway. Uh, I don't have enough for stairs. Huh. Well, it's fine. We'll work with it. Let's use this as a building block. Let's go up. And then we'll put that like that. And that. And that. Oh. Oh. Uh oh. Like, like, like that. And like that. Go away. Look at it. Ow. And then... It's kind of just like a, a random frame type thing. But I think that takes away from the overall fountain. The simplicity of it. I think... I don't know. I can leave it for now. It's, it's really an irrelevant detail at this at this stage. Um, I'm going to pause real quick. I'm going to go... Uh, pick out the screenshot of how I did this in creative. <laughs> Hold on. Okay. All right. All right. We're good. We're golden. Now, now I know exactly how I built this. I just really did. Wait. <laughs> Where did I? Did I plant that and it just grew and I only just now realized, or was that there? Well, now I feel stupid. Huh. All right, well, we can, we can live with it. Deal with it. Okay. So in the corners, I basically did this. Hello. Move the flowers. And then in the middle, I did a little planter type thing. Four, oh, four around. And then like that. I like that. So that and all right. I'm sorry, bud. <laughs> sorry to take your flower. Hey, you're pollinated anyway. Whatever, it's fine. You'll forgive me. <laughs> oh, excuse me. <laughs> I couldn't even stop that. All right. So the tents I did. Uh, they're one, two. Th I'm thinking. I'm also looking at the screenshot. They're one, two, three. There's six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Like that. And then, like that. Move. Like that. And then, I put a trapdoor over there. Kind of like an entranceway. I need more fences. That's, that's a problem. <laughs> let's, let's make some. Uh, oh, I got one there. Definitely gonna need more in the future, but it's fine right now. I don't need everything to be perfect. Well, we have, we have time. We have plenty of time. We have plenty of time to be perfectionists. Perf perfectionists. All right. Uh, since I have it, I'm gonna do red and white. So like that. Like it. Like it. Um, that goes all the way around. I think. Is there? That's fine. It's like it's like a checker pattern, right? And then. 
Okay, it works. It works. Thank goodness. Um, and then on top, let's get our building block back up. Like this. Oh, wait. Oh, uh oh. Not like that. Like this. Yeah. And uh, there's a tent. There is a tent. And then we'll put a chest or whatever in there. And. Um. You know, in the future, by the time we have everything built, my goal, I might have to install a mod that shows me the light levels everywhere on, the, on every block, but I'm going to go through every single block in this whole place, make sure it is perfectly mod-proof. That way, uh, you know, I don't have to worry about villagers dying. Theoretically, I, I'm, I'm going to have to look into details. And see if I had to worry about zombies spawning anyway, because just because they're here, and I know there's like zombie sieges or whatever. But um, we'll find out, I guess. Maybe the hard way. I don't know. All right, I want to do. Yeah, we'll do it on this side. It it feels kind of weird to have the entrance over there. All right, like a that. Now, uh, I need different. I need different wool. I don't want to do more. I want every single tent to be its own color. So what we can do for now is just go around and uh, <laughs> I'm thinking as I'm going, okay, give me a break. So on this side over here, do I need, is this where I want to build the farm? I feel like the farm should be further, like, over there, uh, in the lower end district. Because, realistically, like, all the shepherds and stuff, they're, they're gonna be, like, I, th I feel like they're gonna be in the lower end district. Um, as far as, like, class and everything goes. I don't really know how we're gonna do it yet, but I think, ju that's just the way I think. I think that over here makes the most sense to have a farm. Um, even though we're kind of decorating the area as if it's a little better. So, I think we'll just do, we'll just do it like this. We'll have these two entrances and those two, uh, blocked up. So, the way that I did this is I put a, oh, wait. What? 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 Yeah, like that. Yeah. I thought I was going crazy for a second. I was like, how does... How did I do this? <laughs> um, like that, and then I put, does that need to be, oh, I put this out one too far. Like that, and then, this is kind of turning into like a weird tutorial thing. <laughs> How to build a pretty shopping place. It reminds me of a carnival, but it's not like, it's not gonna be about games, it's just like shopping. It's like a fa oh, it's a farmer's market. That's what it is. Finally, I figured it out. That's that's what I think it's closest to. Um, up here, gonna put a, a lantern, a redstone lamp, whatever. It's a lantern. If if you don't like me calling it a lantern, you can kiss a butt. You can just kiss a butt. I don't care. I I don't care. Okay. Um, what am I doing? I need. I need slabs. I need cobble slabs. I think I want to make these bricks in the future, but I'm doing this wrong already. But for now, it's fine. So I did this one, two, three, four. Oh, oh, ah, I'm screwing everything up. There we go. Uh, but, uh Jesus. Like that. Maybe I'll make these two tall. I think that works. We can make it a little bit random. I'm sorry. I'm not. I'm. Oh, I'm trying not to burp right now. Oh, so they're a little bushier. They're a little bushier bush. <laughs> uh, that's a weird statement that I never thought I'd say. But it's fine. It's fine. Uh, this is. I think it butts up, right? Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six. There we go. One, two. Yep. 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 Yep, yep. Yeah. Did I just hear a skeleton? 
I really thought I'd just sort of skeleton rattle for a second there. What am I doing? I need trapdoor. Like that. Now, I have the basic idea of this down. I'm going to redo the fountain. I'm not happy with it, and it's not the way I did it before. I was trying something different, but I'm going to change it up. So by the time you see this next, I'll probably do it off camera. It'll probably be different. Um, I need to go ahead and get some more wool, even though these are about to break. And one, two, three. <laughs> yep, there we go. I, I need white wool. I need specifically white wool. I actually don't even need red anymore. Um, but I need white wool to re-dye. I could just go ahead and re-dye the red. Let me go get some dye and flowers. Uh, and some more shears. I should probably make it like two sets of shears. So as soon as I do this, um, I'm going to go adventure a little bit. And we're going to go find some gravel. I actually think I know where some gravel is. But it's fine. We'll worry about it later. I want to see some new land. Uh, that's not where that goes. Bop. And all my iron is upstairs. Let's eat real quick. Get the munchies. I like the skull. I like the one wither skull up there next to the candles. It's cool. It's very cool to me. Uh, shears. Yeah. Four. Perfect mundo. There we go. Okay. Uh, we have dye, actually. I want some... It makes more sense to be for them to be white wool. So I can re-dye it. Because I don't want to have to go through and, like, re-dye them all as soon as I get everything. You know what I mean? Uh, it would be smart as I go ahead and bring a bed with me. Because I'm going to adventure and I'll probably be out longer than I want. I should empty my inventory, too. Because I'm going to be going out. And then I'm going to have to collect a whole bunch of gravel. And I don't really want to have a full inventory because I want to collect everything that I want. Uh, let's put that away, that away. I need some wood. I don't need leaves, so I can leave that. I need to put that back where it goes. <sighs> I can put that up there for now. Uh, stone, put that away. Dot, 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 dot. Save my bucket. I don't need... I don't need my bow on me. I don't even have arrows or infinity. Did I sleep? No, I didn't. I'm so smart. <laughs> That's a joke, right? That's a joke. I'm not smart. I just swatch, swatched. You'll see a black screen, possibly. It's fine. It's fine. I switched over taps. All right, let's put that away. And I think I'm set. I can put the rest of this stuff in, in, in here. Oh. Let's... How many... I'll just take that. It's fine. Um, I think I want yellow and blue together. Yellow and light blue, maybe. I think that makes sense. This is light blue, right? Oh, no, it's blue dye. Huh. We don't have any green dye. We don't have any cactuses. Huh. Maybe we'll find a desert and uh, get some cacti. I just, re I realized I just said both terms. I said cactuses and then cacti. I realized. <laughs> <laughs> All right, over here, over here. I'm already getting distracted. Uh, white dye. Gonna dye some of them red. Come here, boy. You, and you, and you, and you. Get rid of the gray. I don't even need the gray. That's what I need to do. You. You. Who are you? Who are you? Who, 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 who? I really wanna know. Come on, give me all your wool. All your wool belong to me. I just placed a torch. I don't need that on my hotbar. Whatever. Left hand. Same thing. Come on. Give me all your wool. Can you imagine how bad this area would smell? <laughs> like, I know it doesn't have to smell bad, but I just feel like it would. I've never been around cows that didn't stink. And I have been around cows. Because I, I, I lived a lot in the south, filler. Been around some cow farms in my day. Um, okay. Let's go ahead and build one of these tents real quick. And then, then we're Gucci. Um, let's, let's go slow. I don't want to make too much. Like that. And like that. I think that should be good, actually. I, I feel like it should be good. Alright, let's start. One, two, three, four, five, six. 
Like that. I gotta remember to do this correctly. I don't want to mess it up. Like that and like that. Oh, yeah, I, I did make too much. I, I need less than I thought I did. Like. Like that. And pop. 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 Nice! Look at that! Ah. Yeah. <laughs> it looks like the best buy tent. <laughs> Alright, uh... Let's make a chest right here and just plop all of our stuff in it. Right. Uh, we'll just go ahead and put it in here. Pop. And then do that. Oh, I want my bucket. Don't take my bucket. Okay, I got my bed. I got, I don't need any shears. I got that. I got that. All righty. Let's go on an adventure. Yeah, yes. Okay, so I'll, I don't think I've been that way. I don't really want to climb the mountain, but I, I think that's like the one direction I haven't been. I know it's that way. I kind of know it's that way. I've probably been all the way around, but I think I want to go this way. How long have we been recording? Oh, we haven't. We got like, give or take 20 minutes. We're good. We're golden. Um, I might try and just cut until I get to the top because parkour is kind of boring. <laughs> it's just going to be messing up a lot. So uh, I'll be right back. I also need a drink. Okay, I, I, I'm back. I'm, I'm just coming back. Look at this. Look at how cool this is right now. This reminds me of, um, like the, I don't know why. It just reminds me of something of Lord of the Rings or Skyrim. And that is, oh, we can make this like a dragon cave or something like that. Like whatever the, the first monument, the first dragon or whatever that you go to in Skyrim, the most popular one. I'm sure you know what I'm thinking if you've seen, if you've been in the game. But we could, like, totally recreate that here. Maybe not that because it's like a flat castle type thing. But, like, we could do something cool in the vibe of Skyrim. Which, like, works because, you know, we're going Minecraft medieval. Look at the pack we're using. So that... No... That could be cool. And we got like black stone and deep slate now, so we can make it like a darker, darker vibe. Ooh, I like it. I definitely want to do stuff around the top of the mountain too. Like I don't want to just be inside of it. <laughs> Giggity. No, I don't want to be just in, the, in like the ground level. I definitely want to do stuff all the way around. I'm getting all kinds of like <laughs> recipes for getting the, the actual ore with silk touch. I didn't even know you, like, got recipes for that. Definitely want the iron, though. That's, that's nice. Give, give me, give me. Yeah. Um, we need to go caving. Oh, that leads all the way through. Oh, cool. Huh. The more you know. Let's just light it up a little bit. A little bit of moniker in my life. Okay. A little bit of iron. And I'll grab this and then we'll go. I realize I'm getting distracted. So, oh, <laughs> the, the irony there. <laughs> I realize I'm getting distracted. Ooh, piece of candy. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> Yo, this world is the best. I, I have not seen a world this awesome. And I'm not, I, I realize I'm a little biased, but like, not really. This world is the coolest seed I have seen since, like, the old, like, beta versions of Minecraft back when you had really wild terrain. Hello, I see you down there. Hello. There's more caving. We really need to go caving more and get some, get some stiffs. Look at that, though. Look at that entrance. That's epic. Pumpkins. I should make a, a telescope so I stop using the Optifine thing because the telescope's in the game for that reason. And I'm just totally neglecting that. I, I've become too reliant on zooming in. Oh, there's more. Yo, imagine if this is even bigger and cooler. <laughs> oh, I'd be so mad. <laughs> but then we could do like an imposing force type. Like our, our area could be like the light side and this could be like the dark side. I should have brought a horse or like a saddle for a horse because we got some over there. I actually want to see if this is cooler or not real quick. Hello, chickens. Oh, you're totally black. 
You're like, oh. You're like a murdered out vehicle, but a chicken. All right, let's go up here. Let's go up here. Come on. Come on. So, uh, you guys want to hear a funny story? Um, I ate. I ate it yesterday. <laughs> so, some of you might know. <gasps> some of you might know. <clears throat> Excuse me. I am a skateboarder. Let's not choke to death here. Um. Oh, like that. Uh, like that. <laughs> All right. So yeah, some of you might know that I'm a skateboarder, and uh, I skate pretty regularly, right? It's like my my hobby. It's what I do. Uh, for the longest time, like when I was younger, I wanted to go pro, and to be honest, I I took. Like, moving around, life happens. Um, there were several times I moved into places, because I moved around a lot with my parents growing up. Um, there was there was times where I just I couldn't skate. There was nothing around me. Like, not even concrete for me to skate. So, I feel like if that hadn't happened, I and if I skated like every day like I wanted to as a kid growing up, I feel like I could genuinely be at a pro level at this point. But... There, there have been years, like months at a time, close to a year at a time, where I just didn't skate. So, that's like one of my biggest regrets in life. But anyway, I'm getting sidetracked. This area isn't quite as big as I had hoped. That's what she said. Um, it's kind of cool, though. It's kind of cool. It's like a valley. Um, but yeah, yesterday, I was skateboarding at my local park. It's just a small little park. It's got, like, metal ramps and, uh... Like, it's, uh, like, I don't even know. It's kind of like a plasticky, there's lava down there. It's like a plasticky material. It's slick, and it grinds and slides pretty well. Um, and it's a crappy park. <laughs> it's a very crappy park. But I was skating, I was skating it because that's what I do. And I was trying to film a clip with one of my good cameras like really zoomed in shot of like the grind like a wheel is grinding in slow motion which i was doing and i wasn't landing i wasn't doing it in a way that i was happy with it so i just kept on trying it to get it like a really clean clip and one of these tries there's a bit of angle iron it's really aluminum but it's what we just simply call it angle iron it's like just a, a, an angle like a 90 degree angle um on the edge of the of the ledge because it grinds better um and it's like a straight thing, so you don't slip out by it being a rounded ledge. Um, and I missed the grind, I think. I don't even know what happened. But I'm totally... Ooh. This doesn't do anything yet, does it? <laughs> I'm gonna take it anyway. I'll take the flower pot, too. Because I can! I'll go to sleep. Um, but I missed the grind. I landed on top of the really slick stuff, I think, is what happened. It all happened so fast. I Like, I just... I was just on the ground. <laughs> it it kind of sucks. Um but yeah, I think I landed like on top of the thing and I slipped out. It, the board went behind me and then like I tried to jump off, step off of it. Then I stepped back on the board cuz it just wasn't out of the way. Ooh. Take that. Um so I stepped back on the board, then I tried to step on the ledge with my other foot and I missed. And then I just went down. I was going down on the ledge. I'll take the bricks. I was going down on the ledge. Like, I fell onto the ledge. And this is like a four-foot or so uh, ledge. It's kind of skinny, too. Like, two feet in, in, in width or whatever. I don't even know why I'm taking all this, but I just, I just feel like I want it. <laughs> I, I'm a real pillager right now. I'm going to take all this, too. I'll take the wheat. Thank you very much. But yeah, so I, I fell directly down onto the ledge. I fell onto my knee on the on the angle somehow. You know how you fall on your knees and it's usually like on the like down by your shins. It's like down like on the bottom of your knee. Well, I somehow managed to land on the top side of my knee. So I have a bit of a cut there. From the angle of the of the ledge. It's a weird... It was a weird fall. So then I... This is a really long story for something that happened in like a split second. But I'm just trying... I'm also trying to replay it in my head. Um... Whoa. 
This is some cool planes. So I like then fell over on like to the uh, like uh, on the end of the ledge is where I fell. Uh, so I slipped. I fell onto it, and then my my momentum like right here I fell, and then I was I had momentum, so I fell like right here at the end of it, trying to jump over it as I was falling, and I landed right here on on the ledge with my knee, and then I fell over this way. And I, my body was like this way, uh, facing this way, and then going that way. And then my foot on this side slipped out from under me, and I ate shit. So I hit my chin. I hit, I hit my face on the ground right here, just skirting that way. So right on the top side of my chin. I could have knocked my teeth out. I don't know how I did it. But on the top side of my chin, I scraped the skin off. <laughs> so, and this is the first time that has happened to me ever like I've never fallen on my face holy shit um so I have like it looks like I was in a fight or something <laughs> I uh, I just have like a scab on my on my chin now and it hurts not gonna lie my knee really my knee hurt worse yesterday but today I didn't even really notice it when I got out of bed which is good so is there really no gravel around here? Is this a is this a total failure? There's got to be like I got to go up into the mountains. That's that's where the gravel will be. So yeah, long story short, I slipped out, fell on my face, and now I have a big gash in my chin. Don't need stitches. It's just a scrape. It's like road rash basically. So that happened yesterday. <laughs> it's pretty fresh in my mind. And I was trying to recap it in my head as I was telling, like, what happened. Like, trying to figure it out myself, because it was one of those falls. If you've ever fallen hard, you don't expect to fall. And then you're just on your ass. <laughs> like, in a split second. You don't even realize that you're hitting the ground until you're, like, recovering from it. That's how it was. Also, I need to make sure. I, I came from that way. I came from... The, I came from east. I'm going west here. Um, Maybe I should have gone back to the area that I knew. Because I just need gravel at this point. I'm going a little far for all this. Huh. I'm going to go up here and then I'm going to cut back if there's nothing there. That's that's That'll be the end of this. And then um, I'm just going to collect a whole bunch of gravel off camera. And by the time... I'll probably be back home by the time you see me. If anything happens, then I'll start recording the next episode from the moment that I died or whatever happens. <laughs> I don't know. Anything can happen. I don't think I'll die, but maybe I just jinxed myself. I don't know. Okay. This. This is just a dead end, basically. All right, we're cutting back. I'm gonna go around this way, though. Um, Somebody else commented in, in an older episode of the Let's... Wait a minute. This is where I was <laughs> in like an episode or two ago. So yeah, huh? Huh? Okay. Okay. So I went around this way the long way. Um. So I've already been over here. Huh? That's weird. Oh well. Whatever. <laughs> I'm I'm totally turned around now. So. Did I go up that? I think I went up that. I am so confused at, right now with that, at what just happened. Huh. Alright, so anyway. In like episode... It was episode 5. Somebody commented. Uh, Jeffrey Greer. I think that's how you say. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Uh, uh, <laughs> I'm sorry. Ah, come back here. A little shit. Uh, they said in the comment, Hey, Ethix, do you have a first video or one of you speaking about when you started to stream? And by that, I'm assuming make videos in general because I'm not really a streamer. Like, I'll stream here and there, but that's not what I do really at this point in my life. Um, so when you started to, to make videos or stream, I would like to give it a shot this year. And I absolutely encourage that. Do it. 
there's nothing stopping you. If you have a microphone or anything, um, I would suggest using a headset if you don't have... Wait a minute. This is this is my home. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh my god. So if I go around this way, the long way... Yeah, I'll, I'll go around a long way. Um, I'm basically just going to tell this... Uh, talk about this comment real quick and then I'm going to end the video. Then I'm going to go all the way around that way on the other side of everything. Towards the swamp. That's where there's a gravel area on top of a mountain. That's where I'm going to go and uh, fill up my inventory with gravel. But I'm just going to talk about this real quick. Um, absolutely start it. Just use a headset mic or whatever if you have a computer. Um, there's a software called OBS. There are tons of OB other other softwares that you can use. If you're on a console, um, you can use what's called an Elgato game capture. That's what I use. Or I would recommend Razer's version. I'm not sponsored by anybody even though I wish I was, especially Razer. <laughs> but they have one, I believe it's called the Ripsaw. That's another capture card. And uh, if you don't know what that is, you can just look into it. I don't know how old you are, so I'm just going to assume that, uh, you know, you can you can figure this stuff out without help. But obviously your parents can help too, because they helped me when I started out too. That's not something to be ashamed of. I don't think, like, take all the help you can get by anybody um, if you need it. Like, it is what it is. Like... Uh, there's always room for improvement. Uh, there's nothing wrong with getting help <clears throat> if it's around. Because that's a valuable asset, in my opinion. Oh, boy. Um, so, yeah. Uh, there's tons of other softwares that you can use uh, for the PC as well, if you have a computer. Um, if you're using a Mac, I don't recommend using a Mac for streaming because... Or for any video creation on games, because... I, I can't say for sure. I've never used Mac. But that's not the industry standard. I just think computers, like PCs, Windows are better. But it is what it is. Whatever preference. It doesn't really matter. Um, but I was just I would recommend using a decent Windows PC. There are things like Fraps, uh <coughs> uh, uh uh X Split. I used that for a while. There's tons of other stuff that I, I can't even think of right now. But yeah. Uh is it more... Uh, I'm reading the rest of it real quick. Is it more precious and awarding than you could have thought? And just wanted to know if uh, there was re regret to it with not having people so much around daily. So... Uh, the way I would say is... This has turned into a more serious topic than I usually get into. <laughs> I'm sorry. If, you, if you're still around, uh, I hope... This is somewhat interesting to you. Because this can apply to anybody, really. Uh, it can. It absolutely can. Um, is there... Is it more... How did it... How, I'm sorry. Is it more precious and awarding? Is it more awarding than I could have imagined? Absolutely. I never thought I'd get to the point that I'm at right now. And I'm not even, like, a big channel or anything. I'm In the grand scheme of things, I am minuscule. I am basically... <laughs> I basically nothing, especially with the amount of active subscribers that the channel has, which is like a couple hundred out of 30 something thousand. Um, that's not good. Uh, I have the thing that I've done that's bad, I would say, from experience and, ser and hearing from other people, is I've had videos, specific videos, go quote-unquote viral or just done well and the worst thing that you can do is have a one-off success in anything and not know why it happened so that's the problem that i've run into i just uploaded a random video that apparently youtube liked the title of in gta and that was pushed out to over a million people it it was shown uh it was it, the, with the reach of it like how many times it was shown is in a couple million i think but overall, it has like 1.1, maybe 1.2, close to it, million views. And that's where most of the subscribers have come from. And they are only around for GTA content. And that's not my primary focus. I don't really focus on putting GTA content out that much. Like, I have a dedicated series to it. Um, and it would be smart to put more of it out. But that's just... I, I, want a more, I want more of a variety. And that's where I messed up is... I... Uh, I have a dedicated, I have 
a specific audience to something that I don't post a lot. Um, if I had more of an overall audience that cared more about me than the videos and the, the what the videos are on, then subscribers would be way more active. And that is nothing that you can really do about it, but that's just something out of experience that I've learned is uh, you definitely want to have effort, the same amount of effort put into every video. And if you can not make it specifically about the game, that's the way I would do it because I don't really focus on specific games is I think where's the gravel thing? It's up here, right? I, I think, I think so. Um, so yeah, overall, just, I wish my regret is not having, um, uh, knowledge to know that if you have a specific audience, um, and if you, if you post different things and get, uh, viewers for each thing and you split your audience up, that's like the problem with it all is I, I have, I have a split audience. Now it's like a little bit of it is pretty primarily Minecraft and, uh, most of it's GTA and not many people really come back to, to stuff because they're, uh, they're so split up. So that is the biggest regret. Um, and also not learning more about SEO to get the videos pushed out to people and picked up by Google and YouTube. Google uh, used to be the primary search engine, but now YouTube is its own search engine. So you have to focus on that just as much as anything else. Um, if you want videos to be seen, which obviously most people that are uploading do. Uh, it's kind of just the way it is. That's just the way it is. Um... But overall, ah, oh, there it is. Overall, like, yeah, it, everything I do, I love. I love posting new videos. I love recording and then editing, like getting the video edited and finally being happy with it and hitting the render button and then getting it live, like pushing the live button when everything's done. That, like creating the thumbnail, everything. It's so pleasing. It's, it just, it, it I love it. Um. And then seeing people like the comment of the video today, they said that they love the video and this is like their favorite series. Like that's all I could wish for. It doesn't have to get thousands, millions of views. Like the fact that some of you are commenting stuff like that is the best outcome I could ask for. So I just want to say thank you for that. Thank you for being around. Um, and I'm reading the comment again. Yeah, I think that's that pretty much covers everything. I just I encourage anybody if they want to do it. I wanted to do this since I was like 10 years old. <laughs> and then I started when I was 14. I got my Elgato capture card on like July 3rd of 2014 and like the on the 5th or 6th, I uploaded my first video with my friends. It was god awful. It was just us screwing around with terrible audio, um terrible music. Just it was just awful. Terrible audio uh editing. And I thought that's all that it took. Uh, I, I mean, I was happy with it. That's all that matters, really. But looking back on it, it's really bad. <laughs> In my standards today, I, I'm a perfectionist, and I try to do things on a professional level, even though um, I don't need to. That's just me. And obviously, I still have room for improvement. It's not as perfect as I, as I sometimes think or wish it was. But that's just me. Like, I'm sure other, other people can relate to that. Uh, but yeah, overall, I think, I think that pretty much covers everything uh, as far as that comment. So thank you for asking the question and I, I wish you all the best. I wish anybody all the best who uh, is thinking and wants to start making videos streaming. Um, I don't really have much experience with streaming, so I can't really give much <laughs> advice for that. But I, my main advice that I got, I talked to a few of the Hermitcraft guys in real life when I met them. At, a, at an event and I asked them about like YouTube and if they had any advice and they said that from their experience just post on a regular schedule love what you do if you don't if you're doing it for the wrong reasons you're not going to get anywhere um, and if you do you're not gonna you're, you're not gonna like it 
<laughs> if you don't enjoy what you're doing and you're doing it anyway for like the wrong reasons, it's just going to be miserable. So enjoy what you're doing if you really want to do it and focus on learning SEO and do it right. Every video needs to have the same amount of effort put into it. That's something I struggle with. Sometimes I just shit out a video that I'm happy with or that I feel like needs to be uploaded or whatever. Sometimes, sometimes. Um, but the SEO needs to be the main focus, especially on YouTube as a search engine to get any eyes on it whatsoever. So that is the main advice that I've got. And that's the main advice that I have for, for anybody else to learn SEO. Um, if you don't know what that means, just look it up and yeah, that's it. I think that's it. I'm going to call it. I'm going to get the rest of this gravel. I want to thank you all for watching the video. If you're still here, go ahead and comment what, uh, uh, I don't know. Comment something. <laughs> Come up with a random word. Come up with a random phrase. I don't know. Just do whatever. I'm not your daddy. You can figure it out yourself. So, I love the music starting right at the end. <laughs> I want to say thank you. I hope you enjoy. See you in the next episode. Let me know what you want to see in the next episode if you have any ideas. Until then, take care. Adios. Amigos.